Hi guys, welcome to my channel Grammar at 7. My name is Radha. Today I am going to talk about subject verb agreement while using plural and singular nouns. I'll be covering all the rules of subject verb agreement. So if you are not subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe right now. Two nouns qualified by each or every require a singular verb. This rule is to be followed even though they are connected by and. So in a sentence, if you have each or every, if you're using two nouns as well, then you need to add a singular verb even though you use and to, and to connect those two nouns still. Have a look at these examples. Each boy and each girl was asked the same question. In the sentence, boy and girl, they are two different nouns but they are clubbed with each and hence you use was that is a singular verb. Every cat and every dog is playing on the ground. Cat and dog, these are two nouns but they are associated with every and hence we are using the singular verb is. There are few nouns which are always in plural form, but they take singular verbs. Here are a few examples like news, wages, politics. If you look at it, these are always in plural form because it comes with an S. But you have to take these as singular, uh, you have to take singular verbs with these nouns. For example, I heard the news is true. So even though news sounds to be plural, you're using a singular verb. Politics is not my cup of tea. Politics you use is, which is a singular verb. The wages was given on time. Again, wages, even though it comes with an S, you're using was, which is a singular verb. That's it for now guys. Please subscribe to my channel for more such videos. Give a thumbs up if you like my video and share it with your family and friends. Bye.